All right, we're here with Mayor Mark Bowden. Mark, you got some big shoes to fill now, I'm telling you. <laughs> the largest Uncle Sam statue in the world, isn't he? Right here in the city of Danbury, part of the land of giants at the great Danbury State Fair. We brought him back, reconditioned him, thanks to the generosity of our donors and in-kind contributors, and it just we made it happen. So it's awesome. I think it looks great. And he's all lit up at night, too. Yeah, well, I know a lot of people are really elated that this statue is back where it belongs after so many years up in the Catskills. But great to have him back here, and good job doing it all, pulling it all together. We do appreciate it. Thank you very that. much. I want to thank Chad Gillette, too, the previous owner, who was just awesome at working with us and uh, selling us this piece. And uh, we're excited. It's a big deal for the city and a great day for Danbury. It's definitely a big deal, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> He's a big one. Good to have Uncle Sam back where he belongs. Absolutely. Thanks. Um, and so I'm Mayor Mark D. Bout, and I want to welcome all of you here today uh, as we formally dedicate Uncle Sam. Uh, you know, it's important for us to grab a piece of our history when we see it and when we know it and put things like Uncle Sam and certainly other projects that we have out there, other pieces of Danbury history and bring them back to our city. I'm going to ask Cindy Merkel from Union Savings Bank to come forward because they were the first to step forward and say we want to help with this project, we believe in it and it's going to be a lot of fun. I think Union Savings is becoming the monument bank, uh, working on the <laughs> monument, the Hatter Monument over at City Hall. But this is a great day for the town of Danbury and the city of Danbury. And again, it would not have happened without this gentleman behind us. So thank you for letting us be a part of it. Congratulations. 150th anniversary this fall of the great Danbury State Fair. I thought it would be appropriate for Jack Stetson to come forward Give us a few words and a few thoughts. Jack? Thank you, Mr. Mayor, for bringing two relics of the Danbury Fair here this afternoon. This wonderful Uncle Sam and myself. In 1979, the fair administration signed a um, agreement to sell the fair to the Wilmer Wright Company. For two more years, we ran the uh, fair, and the 1981 fair was the last one. And I'm so pleased that we're able to bring back a piece of it in, in uh, person, if that's a person, of Uncle Sam, and I thank you, Mayor, for achieving that. Thank you very much. I'm going to ask Antonio Idrola, uh, our Director of Public Works, who had the job after I made the deal for Uncle Sam of getting him from Lake George, New York, uh, here to where you see uh, in his uh, place. And two of them. There's another one, just like Uncle Sam, that is in um, Ohio right now. But they were commissioned by a business owner in Toledo who wanted two Uncle Sams to hold hamburgers in front of his hamburger establishment. So the hand that you see was actually turned the opposite way and was holding a big hamburger. <laughs> but the hamburger was so big and it, it, it created such a leverage point that it, he kept Uncle Sam kept falling on his face. So they eventually got rid of the hamburger, and he just stuck out there for years, basically looking for money. Okay, um, now, uh, there's been a, a little debate about who has the tallest Uncle Sam in the world. So I wanted to spell that debate right now. This is the tallest Uncle Sam statue in the world. All right? The one out in the Midwest does not count. It's standing on a platform, a wooden platform that's about 15 feet high. Um, at this time, I'm going to ask Paul Valeri as a representative of the Danbury Museum and a trustee there just to spend a few minutes with some thoughts and reflections. And then I'll have some final thoughts. We're going to cut a ribbon, uh, and he will be officially dedicated. So, Paul. Paul, we really thank him sincerely for the teamwork and effort that it took to bring Uncle Sam to, to Danbury. And Mayor Mountain, you are to be applauded for that effort. It is one heck of an opportunity for us here in the city to have this here. And you know why? It's really this simple. You come upon this and you feel like a kid. Yep. All right, we're going to do a countdown. You guys ready? Oh, come on, are you ready? Yeah!